Hello everyone, TCG Hobbies here again, back at it again with another video. And in today's video, I'm going to be opening this um, RCSV Star Ultra Premium Collection Box. Um, I can't really fit it all on the screen, <laughs> but I'm going to try my best. Um, initially, I was going to keep this for a sealed collection. Um, I wasn't really going to open it because I thought it looked nice, but came to the realization that the plastic wrap is kind of already sh um, ruined. And then, I don't know if you can hear that, um, there's some components that are kind of loose. I don't want to, I don't want to risk like anything being damaged. I mean, I do have another one, but that one I was going to use like to like sell it or, or trade it for something, but I think I'm going to just keep the other one that's not sliding around on the um, seals and this one I'm going to just open for myself. This looks pretty nice though. I do have some Charizard UPCs that I've been wanting to open, but I don't know if I want to open those just yet. Not to mention, I also kind of need the box as well for like storage, which is kind of nice, which would be nice to have. But yeah, let us begin actually. So I don't know exactly what's in it. I could have read the description on the back, but I mean, I kind of want to be surprised. So, sorry, I had to go grip my sleeves. Let's see what we have in here. So I'll obviously the packs. Oh, well, I guess I'll go with the promo cards then first. Oh, these are metal. I think those were just regular promo cards, no? But these are metal cards. Oh, that's cool. One of the fit and sleeves. <laughs> Don't want the metal to get um, scratched. Uh, let's see what's in here. Oh, the V Star counter. Some metal die. And the metal coin. Pretty cool box. I like this so far. Let's see. Oh, I'm assuming this is a playmat. I know. I know the playmat was what a thing that I saw. And I do. I have been needing new one, so that was kind of one of the reasons me buying it. Because like, I first I initially didn't want to open it, but then again, the playmat would have been nice. Because I want to try to get into the actual card game. Oh, it's really nice. Let me roll this up real quick. Yeah, but like I've been trying to get into the actual card game, but the format's always changing. Um, and then the metal decks are pretty expensive. So I don't know if I can afford to jump in it um, how it currently is. But I do want to plan to get into it. Oh, this one came, this comes with Evolve in Skies. Interesting. That's really interesting because on the back of the box it doesn't show Evolving Skies. It shows more vivid, um, vivid voltage. Okay, that's pretty cool. I knew Lost Origin and then Astral Radiance and then Brilliant Stars were going to be in here. The vivid because of the box. And then 2ES Evolving Skies. That's nice. I mean, I'll take it. So I'm not going to open these in any particular order, I think. I'm going to just grab whatever. <laughs> I'll open this. i open this one first. Yeah, but I hope you guys have been seeing that I've been uploading um, a little bit frequently lately. I know, um, I've been, because uh, I've been, it took me a while to upload a little bit other stuff because I was trying to upload a specific um, beta that I've been saving for a while. Oh, I'm going to show the card, quote cards if we're going to get a hit or not, so... Make this go speedy. But the thing is, the video I had a um, issue with rendering the video for some reason it wouldn't go through. I ended up giving up on uploading the video. I just ended up just tossing the idea. 
And which sucks because the poles in that video were pretty cool. Another white code card. So I think these are going to be nothing but misses. Yeah, I don't think anything good's going to come out of this. Kind of a bummer, to be honest, considering how expensive the box was. Yeah, I think they're all white code cards. Yeah. Nothing good. Well, I don't know, maybe. Let's see if we can get lucky. Maybe I should have kept it sealed, but then again, I wouldn't have been able to get the play mat. Yep, another white code card. Honestly, really disappointed. <laughs> Alright. Ooh, a black code card. Okay. So for this, I shall do the card trick. But the cards are kind of weird, they're like, bent up almost, like, this way. I don't know why though. A King Hollow. I mean, I'll take it. <laughs> Not the one best card, but I'll take it. I'll leave it up at the end of the video. But yeah, but as far as like uploads though, um, I'm gonna be opening up a lot of product that I've been wanting to open for a while because some of the stuff I really want to um, get out of it. I was initially gonna save it because I really wanted to trade for the cards that I that I that I'm missing in my um one in my sets, white code card, but. Ooh, a radius sneeze learn. That's a hit there. But uh I don't know, like I'm contemplating and keeping it, that stuff sealed and using it as as um stuff that I can use for trades. White code card. But I'm not hundred percent sure. I want to go through with doing that. And uh, yeah, so I'm assuming this is going to be a bust. Yeah, I should have kept it sealed. Should have kept it sealed. Yep. No bueno. Because I mean, I can make a couple more videos out of that stuff. Oh, a black cloaker. Oh, okay. Honestly, I wasn't paying attention. But I'm not disappointed. But like yeah, um I keep rambling on because you get what I'm saying. I'm not too sure though. It all depends. It's a black code card too. It all honestly depends to be completely honest. I could probably get a lot out of it, but I'm not 100% sure. <laughs> like, on one hand, I really want to open it, and the other hand, I'm like, I gotta for sure, I gotta try to trade it. Oh, I don't hear my what? I guess this is a different type of cook card. Oh, 
Oh, that was disappointing. Um, I think I'm okay. So I think I'm gonna end up pulling out on opening more product, at least for another video. Got a black card here for for Lulu's Astral Radiance. Ooh, I should probably do the card trick. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's what I'm gonna do. I'm settled. I'm gonna hold off on making more videos for the time being. So this is gonna be a video that's gonna come out, obviously. Then I'm gonna wait a little bit, see what I can get out of trading if anyone wants to trade for any of stuff. Ooh, Diago V. Okay, okay. If anyone wants to trade it for anything, if not, I'll open the product myself and I'll make a video out of it. Because I could definitely deal without having the problems for a bit. That's for sure. Now I need to stress out the promo cards. Could probably find them a lot cheaper. Just by buying the singles. But we shall see. Let's swap Origins. Last pack of LO. Or yeah, LO. And let's see. A black code card actually, okay. Not too bad. Um, I'm already messing it up, but yeah, we can see that there was a trainer gallery and a Rotom B. Dang. No card given Tina. I would have loved the Tina. The Tina would have been nice, but can't complain. I mean, I am going for the trainer galleries for the newer sets, anyways. So that's another card that I can add to it. Black code card. Oh, give me this is Billy Stars, yeah. Another V Star card. I also have um let me know down in the comments, because I also do have some, I have booster boxes. I have Brilliant Stars and Astral booster boxes that I bought that I thought I was going to open. Ooh, Inertia Fuby in Lucario. That I thought was, that I was going to open, but ultimately I think I'm going to just keep off the trains, because... Because I'm trying to master this set, and all the cards that I need left are the most expensive cards in the set, to be honest. And if I can work out a trade for a set cards without me having to spend a lot more money, I'll definitely do it. And this one's going to be a bad one because, yeah. Yep. Really disappointing. Dang. Oh well. But yeah, so let me... Allow me to show you my pulls. And we'll see them at the same time. So, as always, I thank you so much for watching. And just to give you a quick little recap of my pulls. Couple trainers, not too. I'm um, not too upset about because I really do like them. If anything, I will most likely will be opening at least one 
booster box on the channel. And then the others I will hold on to. Man, I should have bought better different sleeves because these are um, exact fit sleeves and they're pretty um, tight when it comes to sliding the card in. Like they don't go in as fast. As I would like them to. Probably should have separated them from the very beginning, but oh well. More bulk for me to sort through as well. So that one's worked out, and then. Last but not least, this. From Brilliant Stars. I'll sleep them. I'll sleep them up at the myself, so I don't keep you guys here freaking long. If I can find my poles, <laughs> that is. Well, I think I got them all actually. I don't know. I'll look through it. But yeah. We got three trainers, one hollow, two Vs, one full art, oh, two hollows actually, and then one radiant. Well, thank you for watching, and I'll see you on the next one.